Hey, welcome back to YT Finance, and today we are discussing Nano Dimension stock news and how NNDM stock will explode along with the whole 3D printing additive manufacturing industry. This video will be the first part of two videos where I walk you through how 3D printing companies and their technologies are being adopted and how many mergers, acquisitions, and alliances are being formed, which will create an environment for Nano Dimension stock to grow. Regarding some of the stocks mentioned in this video, I want to come clean and say I personally own and hold X1 desktop metal and I indirectly hold NNDM stocks through ETFs. Also, keep an eye out for Stratasys, 3D Systems, Proto Labs, or just buy ARC's PRNT 3D Printing ETF for instant diversification in this rapidly growing sector. Remember to press the like button for this video right now, comment down below your thoughts, subscribe if you are new, and let's make you some free money with Weeble. Weeble is a free brokerage app where you can buy and sell stocks, options, and cryptocurrencies. But right now, you can get two free stocks with Weeble. You can get the first free stock, which can be worth anywhere from $2 to $250 for just creating an account. And you can get a second free stock, which can be worth up to $1,600 if you invest $100 or more on your first deposit. You will have a 1 in 100 chance of getting stocks like Facebook, Starbucks, or Snapchat, and you have a 1 in 50 chance of getting stocks like Google or Procter & Gamble. To get this offer, just press on the link in my description box down below, but do it quickly because this offer will not last forever. And without further ado, let's get into today's stories. In this video and in the next video that I will publish tomorrow, we will talk about the business development partnerships, mergers, and acquisitions that are happening inside of the 3D printing sector. In the next video, I will even tell you all about how we can 3D print foods like salmon and sushi, so subscribe right now so you don't miss out on it. The stocks and companies that I will specifically be talking about today are Nano Dimension Stock, X1 Stock, Desktop Metal Stock, Delray Systems, EOS North America, ABC Corporation, and a few others. If you all are new here, first let's catch you all up on Nano Dimension. Recently, Nano Dimension, ticker symbol NNDM, sold $500 million worth of shares. So if you hold NNDM stock, get used to constant stock dilution. Now, through these stock offerings, Nano Dimension has raised $1.5 billion. That is going to be used to acquire other technology companies that will help Nano Dimension grow, and it will cause the NNDM stock price to skyrocket. I still hold to a short term price target of $25 for NNDM. NDM stock, so I am indirectly buying every dip so I can take profits at $24 and I will let the rest of my investment ride in case NNDM stock goes to the moon, which it definitely could. Now, while a Nano Dimension is trying to find a good merger acquisition deal, Desktop Metal, which has a super strong management team, has already completed an acquisition of DLP Systems and Envision TC for $300 million. So if Desktop Metal can get these great companies for $300 million, million dollars, Nano Dimension should easily be able to do even better. The CEO of Desktop Metal had to say this about the acquisition, and I quote, With Envision TEC now a part of Desktop Metal, we are well positioned to offer customers a complete platform across polymers and metals focused on additive manufacturing 2.0 solutions for volume production of end-use parts. And now desktop metal can start making revenue from the automotive, aerospace, and healthcare industries, which are all extremely lucrative. Desktop metal's ability to penetrate these markets with their new acquisitions could make desktop metal, ticker symbol DM, very wealthy. But Nano Dimension and Desktop Metal are not the only ones who are acquiring other companies because specialty chemical group Altana merged with a metal power specialist company to expand its Eckhart division, which includes its 3D printing technology and its patented alloy A20X technology, which could revolutionize metal-based 3D printing. Simply put, the merged companies can use each other's technologies with one that specializes in metal powders while the other focuses on the atomization of metals, so both together can create metal 3D printing supplements and technology. 
These acquisitions and mergers are super important because, and I quote, with the acquisition, we are expanding our business with functional applications and positioning ourselves in a technological market of the future. Nano Dimension better act fast because many other 3D printing companies are landing massive acquisitions, mergers, and partnerships, and I do not want NNDM to miss out and fall behind on this technology. Even X1, who has the Binder Jet 3D printer, has dubbed ABC Corporation as an authorized channel partner to sell its 3D printers throughout South Korea, which will help their automotive sector. This goes to show that an acquisition, a merger, or even a partnership does not have to necessarily advance the technology inside of a 3D printer. But sometimes, rather, you just need a company to help you sell the printer itself, and Nano Dimension definitely needs to sell more of their 3D printers. Nano Dimension needs to at least acquire three types of companies. First, they need to acquire an AI technology company to make their 3D printers smarter. Second, they need to acquire a company that has a product or service that is complementary to their own. And lastly, NNDM needs a company that can help them sell, distribute, and market their technology effectively to buyers. However, Nano Dimension does have a plan to produce new types of 3D printers, which I have already made a video on when those will be coming out, because X1 already has four units, and I quote, The Innovent Pro is an advanced entry-level metal 3D printer that rounds out X1's full family of production metal binder jetting systems, which includes the X125 Pro, the X1160 Pro, and the X1D1 Automated Guided Vehicle for Automated Industry 4.0 Transport. Most of Nano Dimension's new systems and products don't come out until 2022 or 2023, so I am very anxious to see what technology that they can improve in the meantime before their new units come out. Excellencia Tech has also established a 3D printing partnership to better spread their reach to Spain, Portugal, and South Europe, specifically in the military and automotive sectors. The CEO of the partnering company said this, and I quote, This partnership with Excellencia Tech will be instrumental to cover the markets in South Europe and achieve our goals to provide our target customer with industrial high temperature 3D solutions. The takeaway is that the 3D additive manufacturing market is heating up fast with multiple types of mergers and partnerships going on with a plethora of different 3D manufacturing companies, and I don't want Nano Dimension to be left in the dust if they keep diluting their shares and do not act quickly on a merger or acquisition. Remember to like this video right now for NNDM stock. Comment down below what you think NNDM needs to not get left behind. Thank you to all of my subscribers and I will see all of you in the next YT video.